What goes into making Heartland polymers polypropylene? Quite a lot, actually. Producing polypropylene at North America's first single-site PDH and PP facility is a specialized process requiring precision and expertise. It all begins when locally sourced propane is fed into our propane dehydrogenation facility. The propane is first treated and purified through the feed treatment system. From there, the purified propane moves through the hot pass in the separation system, where it is changed from a liquid to a gas. Next, the propane heads to the reaction section, where a high temperature catalyst compresses and separates hydrogen atoms from propane molecules, leaving us with polypropylene's main ingredient, propylene. The highly compressed propylene, still in gas form, is propelled to the cold box, where the process stream goes from gas back to liquid. The propylene enters the PP splitter where it is further separated and purified, leaving us with polymer-grade propylene. The propylene is then sent to the polypropylene facility, where it is put through a process called polymerization. This process encourages propylene molecules to bond by the thousands, creating polypropylene. Any unreacted molecules are recovered and then recycled for reprocessing, increasing efficiency and reducing our carbon footprint. The last step is to process the polypropylene with additives to meet end-use applications. This refinement takes place in a component similar to a large conveying screw that forces polypropylene through the underwater pelletizer, where it's cut into circular pellets, the final product, all ready to serve our customers with something better.